Present to you flight. <laughs> Up, come on, fly. He might be a little heavy for those wings to work, Leo. Then maybe I just need bigger wings. Hi, Junior Ranger Zari. Hi, Leo. There's a huge moth in my window with part of its wing missing. Oh no, is it hurt? Hmm, hard to say. We'll need more information on this moth. Stay on the line, Zari. See you later, hero. <laughs> Let's see what type of moth it is. Oh, it's an atlas moth. The atlas moth is one of the biggest moths in the world. It's most commonly found in Southeast Asia. Female moths are larger than the males. The males have a wider, longer, and more feathery antenna than the females. It seems the atlas moth that Zari found is a male. The wings of the atlas moth have different shades of red and brown, and they look like maps. That's how the moth got its name, Atlas, which is a collection of maps. So how can we help the moth? Let's figure it out together. We'll be right there. Ranger out. Let's help the Atlas moth fly again. <laughs> I'm fluttering down right now. Ranger Leo all set. Woohoo! Junior Rangers to the rescue! Platypus One, activate! Here we go! Hi guys, thanks for coming! Is the Atlas Moth okay? <gasps> it's trying to fly! It's okay, Hero. It won't hurt you. It just wants a place to rest. I think we can fix this. Really? How? We'll just make him new wings. You know how to make wings? Ta-da! Made these myself. And have they worked so far? No. Maybe we should patch it up. Oh, no! I don't have any plasters left. Only bandages. Those are too big. Oh, would these work? Cool. Maybe this one? Nope. Maybe a triangle will fit? Bingo! Fly, Moth. Fly! Yay! We did it! Maybe the damaged wing won't be a problem if the moth is stronger. We could feed it so that it'll regain more energy. Good idea, Katie. But what do moths eat? Leaves? I've seen caterpillars eat leaves and they turn into moths. Here you go, buddy. Enjoy. Come on, one bite. Here comes the food train. Choo choo. Having trouble, Junior Rangers? Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky! What are you doing here? I was testing the wind speeds to see how it affects flying animals. What are you up to? We're trying to help this Atlas Moth fly again. We tried patching up its wing and feeding it, but it won't eat. I know someone who may be able to help. Let's call my friend Ranger Joey, the ranger who's no stranger to flying animals. Hi, Ranger Joey. Oh, hi, Ranger Rocky. Hello, Junior Rangers. Our Junior Rangers found an atlas moth with a piece of its wing missing, and they're trying to help it fly again. 
Hmm. Well, actually, depending on how damaged the wing is, usually moths can still fly, even if their wings are torn or if there is a piece missing. Their wings are very special. Not only do they look like maps, but the tips of their wings also look like snake heads. So, when a predator, like a bird or a lizard attacks, the atlas moth will flap its wings to make it look like a moving snake, scaring off its predators. Smart, huh? <laughs> but since it's daytime now, your moth is probably just resting and saving its energy for later because atlas moths are nocturnal, which means they are more active at night. And adult atlas moths do not eat. They don't have fully formed mouth parts. That's right. As caterpillars, they'll eat as much as they can to give themselves enough energy to last about one or two weeks as adult moths. During that time, they'll have to find others of its kind to reproduce more moths. That's not a lot of time. We need to help the Atlas moth find a girlfriend right now. Good luck, Junior Rangers. Ranger out. Ranger out. I have to fly back to my wind research. You got this, right? Yes, Ranger Rocky. Bye. Goodbye. Let's begin our search for the moth's girlfriend. Where do we find one? The forest is our best bet. Let's go. Found one. Now they just have to meet. <gasps> oh, no! Jetpack, activate! Oh, no, you don't! You're not getting past me! Shoo! Shoo! You're not getting to our friends! There's one more! What's he doing? And our job here is done. Bye, Atlas Moths. Mission accomplished. I'm glad we helped the Atlas Moth find a girlfriend. Whee! Katie? Woohoo! How did you get them to work? <laughs> it's a secret. Come on, Katie, tell me. Good job, children. You are amazing wildlife rangers. Thank <laughs> you.